up guys? It's Iriwara again for another reaction. So today we are going to continue on some reactions to TV shows and the TV show we are going today is the one and only, maybe, possibly one of my GOATS TV shows of all time, True Detective. Wow. I was like excited already yesterday. Okay, tomorrow is the day that I'll be watching uh, no, the next episode of, uh, you know, True Detective. Because some of the reactions, in this case, some of the TV shows I'm doing, uh, I'm doing because, not because I'm really enjoying a lot, you know? For instance, uh, Mr. Robot, I'm not really enjoying a lot, you know? I'm, it's good, I'm enjoying it, you know? But I do, I keep going because I need to respect uh, uh, my method that I'm currently doing my channel. So I decided to go with my Mr. Robot for season, I will continue until the end. And I'm enjoying it, you know? But True Detective is not because I need to do, because, you know, I, I have to, uh, in my shadow, True Detective, I need to make sure it's done in my channel uh, that you know, specific day. No, True Detective is a TV show that I'm loving it, you know? Kind of like I, just to think that I, I need to wait a week to, you know, because I cannot like uh, react to it every single day. That's how I do my channel, I react to uh, an episode uh, for each TV show almost a week, basically, you know? So it's hard like to be one week without watching this masterpiece. Well, we are coming to an end, so this is not the last, but this is the, the one, no, previous is the last. So we are having two more episodes. Uh, I'm not sure if I will be reacting to the second season, because it's not with Matthew, it's not with OD, whatever, you know, not with Cole and Hart. So uh, I'll be definitely stopping reacting to True Detective, uh, you know, for now. Maybe in the future I'll keep going with the second season, but I will give a shot to other TV shows regarding uh, crime in my channel. I will not keep going with second season. Contrarily, I will keep going with the other TV shows I will, I'm doing. Because, guys, True Detective, they decided to not go with the same actors. That's like a bad thing to do, you know? I think if they will keep the same actors. I know it's not easy because the actors they, they chose to go in the fourth season are all the actors. So I get that the fact that the actors, Matthew or Woody, they mentioned, okay, I will do, but only one season. From this point of view, I get what, why this TV show has not kept uh, no, the, the, the actors. Yes, guys, this TV show is a freaking masterpiece. Last episode was what? Uh, okay, it was, you know, uh, the beef that they had. So, Cole, you now banged Hart's wife. That was crazy. She did that to get vengeance because he was keeping uh, betraying her with a younger uh, no, woman so uh, in my eyes she did the right thing of course i felt for cole because cole you know was used by her but anyway we cannot only put ourselves in the positions of the you no know, the characters we love we need to put ourselves in the positions of any single character you know so from her point of view i, I got it also cole is still on his way to figure out yellow king mystery you know he's trying to and I'll see if actually the guy that killed Reggie Do was the guy behind uh, all this, you know, the, the killing of Dory and the killing of the other girls. His intuition is telling him that no, the guy that was doing all this is still out there, you know. He's like 50-50, but as long as there is the, you know, a small percentage for him to doubt, he will try to make sure that percentage is uh, erased. He want to make sure 100% that he got the case uh, sorted, you know, on point. So I think these next two episodes will be regarding uh, the conclusion, if eventually was Reggie or not. So that's like my prediction about what's going to happen. Maybe it will, you know, will happen this time episode around, because I don't think they should let, you know, something really like a bomb for the last episode. Last episode is like the cool down of the season, no? So I'm pretty sure this episode will be the fucking masterpiece. I'm excited. Yes, guys, I don't keep going with this intro, otherwise this video will be too long. As always, before we jump to the episode 7 of True Detective, please give me a love energy by subscribing my channel. Just one click can make me much more happier, stronger. So, so keep it the right mentor to give me a seat to you guys almost every day. And yes, as always, hope you're having fun. And let's do this, guys. Let's do this. Wow. Let's see this place. Okay, we are with them uh, in 2012. Yeah, we left off uh, at the end of last episode on the time on 2012. Let's see. They have to say to each other. Say so you must have pissed him off. They did it very well. This looks really like 20 years after 
1995. Lake Charles murder. Pshh, look, is completely fucked. I think you don't look particularly healthy. Listening to you talk, your eyes. Yeah. Went back to Alaska, spent eight years working fishing boats, bars. Man remembers his debts. I like Cole, he's so, such a free spirit. When he's 40s, he grabs himself, go to Alaska to fish, to work in bar and stuff. I like that. Oh, I don't owe you. We left something undone. And I've been working on this for two years. You know, not for nothing, but if you wouldn't have clipped the dude back then, we might have got the whole fucking story out of him. Yeah, if a uh, heart had not killed uh, the dude, they would grab some information from him. Yeah, it was a bad move from Hart, man. I need you to help me. Why would I? They got eyewitnesses placing you at the Lake Charles crime scene. So the pictures that they got of him being near the crime scene is because he's trying for the last two years to figure out who was actually behind uh, you know, the, the crimes. I don't think I've been very clear with you, Russ. If you were drowning, I'd throw you a fucking barbell. Jesus. If you'd be drowning, I would throw you a fucking barbell. He has not still, like, completely forgiven him. You know? I have a debt. Huh? That's the way shit went down in 95. Cole, you uh, know, protected Hart. Cole figured out a way to make that crime scene look perfect, you know? That's a debt that he has towards Cole. Cole thinks that Hart should help him because he saved his ass. Cole, even though he looked like fucked from the outside, he's so still so wise, you know? He looks so still sane, you know, when he speaks. Incredible. He's a fucking genius. Look at this place. Why the hell are you? You can tell, it got a little bit overweighted. Nice bank case. I mean, when you get older, it's harder to lose weight. Depends of your metabolism also. What you packing? That's his place. This is where he's doing his research. This place doesn't cost him more than 150 bucks a month. That's why I decided to be here. Cannot afford an apartment anymore. Yellow King's cars. Car Costa? Yeah, he got traumatized by that scene with the guy in a prison and with the girl, that mentally ill house. Women and children going missing. Now you're just throwing up stats. Why well, was Tuttle so interested in the Lane case, huh? 1988, accusations of child molestation at a preschool funded by Tuttle. One of them turned out to be a young man who just showed up for solicitation in New Orleans. Wow, well, guys, so maybe the molestation that he was speaking about Maybe uh, it is all connected. Maybe even Ledoux was one of the kids that was molested. Therefore, he became what he became. Even work for guys such as Tuttle, you know? Why are you asking me about that place? That's how it all started. Memory be fucked. This looks like a scene between him and Jerry Leto on Dallas Club. Favorite man taking pictures. This guy, he became like this because he was molested. That's how a lot of guys, they became, you know, homosexual. Because they were uh, sexually abused as a kid. That's why I decided it had to be a dream. That's why I decided that it had to be a dream. Fuck. It's a good way to kind of like... Uh, a trick. To feel better. Pretend that what happened was actually a dream. You ever see any of these men's faces? Just one. He had bad scars all around his mouth. Like the bottom half got all burned up. Green ears. Now I think that this is our man with the scars on his face. I don't know who he is, I don't know where he is, I don't know where this whole thing fucking starts, but it ends with him. Okay, so there is another guy, tall, with scars on his face, that is not regular. Wow. We got these from a series an artist did in Kenner. Look familiar? I think our man had a real good time after the hurricane. Okay, when you went to that school, you know, there was all those stuff. Maybe that, you know, the teacher that he was mentioning worked on that school that's why those things were there possibly the late reverend billy lee tuttle is his cousin i'm telling you it's a fucking family thing that's what i mean when i talk about the sprawl marty how fucking crazy that sounds yeah. maybe told yourself this story and kept drinking until you believed it just like the fact that you know i know like he has no life kind of he has no family but he's still like he cares about what is wrong out there he wants to make sure the guy is committing all these crimes We'll be caught. We'll be in prison. Incredible. She had an art show in New Orleans. Wow, look at this. Sold some paintings. Oh, that's good. That's great. <laughs> so, he has not been with these daughters for a while. Wow. Look what time does. When I think about them being all together, when his daughters, they were kids. Now think about him not having 
seen them for a while. It's heartbreaking. But they think Russ did something. He didn't. I didn't think he did. I mean, for me, there is like still a small percentage. Cole might be somehow behind all this. I'm not saying like he is, but it's still like something in me that, you know, I cannot deny. Different. Same. I mean, he's lived rough for a long time now. Yeah, it's hard to speak about him because what they had, his wife and him and Cole. All this time, you too, and just, just like that? I took some convincing. I mean, I know that she's fucking rich, but still, like, they should have done her looking more older. Even though, you know, with their money, all the plastic surgeries, always in, you know, an ad dress and stuff. She made sure she is still looking stunning, but I think they failed on not making her looking a little bit older. I mean, if you did something, I don't want to hear about it. Mm, I told you, <laughs> I understand robbery. I mean, what I'm saying is, I was aware that I might have lost my mind. What, like, this house? From whose? Maybe from that uh, Tedal guy? Let's see what you will find it. After the second home. Wow. Let's see what you will find inside of that security safe. These feelings are bad if you don't know what you're looking at. <gasps> Guys, here you go. Motherfucker, yes. Wow, Cole is right again. He is on the right, man. There's a videotape. A fucking videotape. Wow, let's see what is inside. Hopefully not anything, you know, nasty. Take a look. He gave him, you know, some alcohol because get ready for what you're about to meet us. Will be gross. It's a girl, yeah. Let's see what you're gonna do. He go, yeah. She, she's fucking crying. This will make heart. Try to again grab these guys. He go. It's a fucking cultist, guys, man. Yeah. Ah! The video is showing that guy raping the little girl. Jesus fucking Christ. You watch all that? Yeah. I like the detail him giving a heart some drink, alcohol. Not again. Jesus Christ. I want to fit my eyes, not again. So it just meant that I need to fuck this guy, so I need to grab this guys. You killed Toto. No. That's Toto's house. Toto is behind these guys. The guy that he went on that big building on two episodes ago. He's the guy behind all this. I knew it. I mentioned that. Have a look on that, on that reaction. You shouldn't have that. Nobody should have that. Yeah, nobody should see that. Fuck. Thank you for everything. I've seen you in over two years, Marty. Oh, uh, she still Did likes Did you come him. here to say goodbye? You can tell, like, of course. You can never, like, forget old love. <laughs> Heart investigate solutions. Okay, yeah, that's why you mentioned the start of company regarding investigations. Hard investigative solutions. Wow. On call, you got, you got the right guy to be you know, on top of any type of crime. You seen anybody? Not really. Some dates. Now he's like free. He has been with a lot of girls, I can imagine. But that girl you were seeing in O2, whatever happened there? Yeah, that was never gonna last. Oh, the girl that, uh, they kind of like uh, met her when she was fucking 15. Wow, that was crazy. You know, you could have been boss, you know, LT at least. I suppose I, uh, I could have been a painter, you know, a historian. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. From 60 to my last day on the planet Earth, I'll be drawing. All I need from you, Bobby, is some old copies of case files. Tell me that's the same place that they worked before. They have a new, uh, how should I say, Capitan? It isn't gonna be in the computers. You're gonna have to sort through the files. Hmm, that sucks. When you have to look for all the files. Yeah, that's like... Thank you. That's what, you know, computers make life so much easier, you know? Nowadays, you can put everything in your computer, go to the search option, done. Do all the do transfer a title on a truck to a Jimmy Ledoux? Appears like that might be a cousin. Okay. Is there anything you remember that you can tell us about these guys? Reggie was always asking about the girls in my school, and a couple times I saw on the wall just said kooky stuff. They were just psychos, they were just... Psychos. A pop let him use our deer camp once. They introduced us to the guy, his face underneath his nose and cheeks, scarred. Every time I glanced, staring at me. He was a fucking pedophile. He's still with his, you know, book. Ever see him again? The guy with the scars? Never again. Hey, you guys, can't wait to see who this guy is. It's not Reggie. Maybe even like, what? Reggie uncle, Reggie father, let's see. Now I don't understand what this is about. I never knew them tunnel people, but I heard stories. No, thank you. Is, is he turtle or turtle? 
I'm not confused now. You cannot call someone Turtle, come on. Mr. Lord, you worked for Mr. Sam Turtle, 19 years. Turtle, yeah, he's Turtle, jeez. Might have been close to the boys. Those days, families were bigger. Yeah, back in the days. Those were the days that, you know, families, they were actually families. I have 12, 13 ankles slash aunties, so I can relate. You remember one that maybe had scars all across the bottom of his face? His daddy did that to him. I think that child was children's, or what if he was a little boy, children's. Childress, what the meaning of that? So the guy with you know, the scars, when he was a kid, his father or his grandfather did something and beat him or hurt him in a way that he caught that scars from it. That's why he got traumatized and eventually he became evil. You know, Kakosa. Kakosa. What is it? Him eats time. Him with time. Chase! Death is not the end. You need to leave. You know, Kakosa. <laughs> you rejoiced. Again, guys, we're having the same type of scene that we had with the kind of prison, the girl uh, that Reggie got crazy. I just caught the chills, man. Just love this, man. Hits your soul in a way unbelievable. Sure, how that old lady was wrong. About what? That death not being the end of it. Wow, he like, he's so fucked that he doesn't want the death to be the end of life, kind of, you know? He want to make sure when he dies, he dies because he, he is sick of this. He is sick of having everything that he has in his mind, on his mind. Got a name? Steve Geraci. Steve Geraci? Might be a guy that we know. Guys, I'm not good with names, so I'm not getting who Steve is right now. Well, we ain't looking to arrest him, are we? Just have a little chat. That's hey, the guy, the phone, Steve. saying something about that Fontenot girl. The little girl went to live with her birth daddy. That is if I'm remembering right. And you talked to the family directly back then? No, Ted Childress, sheriff. He knew him. Ah, Childress is actually like a surname. Let's do it again sometime. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> okay, I think he got some press information for Cole. Better get Steve. those jumper cables ready. Fuck. Motherfucker's lying. Here you go. No way, hard is planning to fuck Steve's up. No, jeez, way. Wow, let's see. They have to find some space for her still. It's good to see you. Bullshit. <laughs> How long you been back? You got a big house. Marty says the girls are doing fine. That's good, man. I was concerned about the girls, you know? Get on out of here. You're classing the place up. You are classing the place up. First time I heard something like that. You tell me why you come back, for real. Look how he looks like, you know? Hart looks much older. I like the makeup, you know, and very much. I saw something. Tweaker tried to dry the kid in a microwave. <gasps> Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck me. Saw that and what he done. I thought, never again. A baby in a fucking microwave. Wow, guys, it's scary to, you know, to comprehend how cruel a person can become, you know? This is all mental illness, but it's not excuse, you know? This guy need to be shut down. I'm ready to tie it off. See you on the boat. See you on the boat? Wow, let's see. Three years. After the other day, I, I, I was thinking, why don't I see Steve in the boys more? So, guys, see you in the boat. They're gonna fuck this guy here on his boat. I think Rust is close by. Ah, I do love a reason to drink beer first thing in the morning. If I was a guy like him, Steve, I would never be alone with somebody else. Only like maybe my family, you know? But a guy that uh, I would see him from time to time, me being that rich, me having uh, secrets, how come that would not be the possibility of the guy that will be with, who try to fuck me up, you know? I said all I remember about the girl. Let's just have a good time and don't ask again. I ain't gonna ask you. He is. Here you go, I knew it. Jesus, guys. Yeah, what's predictable? You realize who I am now, you assholes? I'll have boss crackers splitting your ass in Angola. Yeah, we'll talk about that and some other things. Come on. Well, on goal is that place that a lot of bad things happen to people, yeah? Jesus, that place might be terrifying. I need to have a look. There might be some documentary out there. Church Cole talked about Swamp. Swampy right here. So they are on top of Cole. Let me know when you see something. Ain't nothing to see. Wow, well, guys, can't wait to see the finale of this episode. Yes, sir. You know there's a little church around here? That place shut down. Hey, you know how to get to 49 from here? Sure. About a half mile, you'll see a left. Know oh. your way around, huh? Oh, yeah, boss. 
I know the whole coast. My family. Thanks. This guy looks like a guy. He's very lonely. That's why he was trying to continue the shot, kind of. But he looks suspicious, you know. Imagine him having the, the scars. <gasps> Guys! My family's been here a long, long time. Guys, he looks like he has some scars, no? Especially here, on his right side. But he doesn't as close to his nose, so he might not be the guy that they are trying to get. But imagine him being the guy. That would be crazy. This scene would mean so much, you know? No way the episode will end like this. If that's so, this guy is a relevant dude. Walk the darkness down, mine is on the midnight. Well, guys, was not expecting, uh, you know, the progression, the involvement of this episode. I thought we'll see something more specifically, you know. Well, definitely the highlight was knowing that uh, these guys, they are cultists, you know, and they are connected somehow with T Turtle or Toto, you know. So Turtle or Toto, the guy behind um, those uh, charities events, you know, he has a hand in all this. I'm pretty sure he is like the guy behind all this. He has not actually a hand, he's the guy behind all this. He is on, on the top of the hierarchy, you know? He is the, the snake, basically, you know? That was my thoughts when he went to confront him. Not confront him, but have a shot with him. Wow, guys. But that scene, Cole showing hard, them raping that girl. This is what they are doing, you know? They are doing these uh, rituals. And then they put these girls in some place else. So they are quite a lot and they have power. They are not irrelevant people. They are actually relevant, you know, or they are connected with relevant people. People that they will always uh, find a way to protect them. That's why they keep doing this. That's why there is no way to make this stop. And that's why in 2012, uh, a similar crime came to the surface, you know? So I was a little bit confused. Uh, Steve something, now I forgot his last name. Who was him? But he is the guy that uh, Hart was playing golf with, and he is the guy that uh, Hart and Cole now on his boat arrested him, kind of, you know? So let's see what Cole will be able to grab from him. Knowing how Cole is, he will definitely get what he wants from this guy. Because he will hurt this guy as much as, you know, he feels it's necessary to get what he wants, you know? So, yes, guys, what these guys have been through cold and hard they are up to do anything to fuck these guys as much as possible before before they go to no, to the other side car yeah. yes uh, the yellow king as well carcosa i'm still not really clarified about it uh those families you know the two uh childress they are connected as well last episode i don't know like how they're gonna be able to explain all this fuck i don't like I will definitely have a look afterwards uh, on some explanations regarding this TV show. This TV show was hard to understand, you know? Hard. And now this guy in the end, speaking with you know, two police officers that they are on Cole's ass, he looks suspicious. He has those scars, you know? The way the director of the show emphasizes him in the end, you know, giving him a longer shot as well. Guys, Maybe this guy might be uh, the duel Ledoux. I still don't know who is the duel Ledoux. The duel Ledoux is not the guy that was with Reggie, uh, with him, on that uh, place that they were, on that on those sheds. Duel Ledoux is not the guy that we are aware of still. Maybe this is the guy. Imagine if this guy uh, that was, you know, cutting the grass uh, is Duel Ledoux. That would be crazy, you know? And that's why he was trying to study uh, the police guys, because he was trying to figure out what, why they are here, you know? And by doing so, he is a show also telling us something. Why he was trying to grab as much information from the police officers as possible. Because the show is telling us that this guy might be one of the guys behind all this. And also, by finishing the episode with him, maybe we'll have more of him next episode around. Guys, makes a lot of sense. So, I don't have that much more to say. Uh, was not an easy episode, uh, was slow paced, uh, but kind of like we are having what 10 uh, pieces that they have only one episode now to put them all together. They decided to do that way. Hopefully, they will be able to do so on the last episode because if Matthew and Woody will not go to the second season, 
they cannot take anything from the first season and put on a second season. That's like my prediction. Or maybe they will with different actors. Possibly. Let's see, guys. Can't wait to see the outcome of the no, the last episode. Yes, guys, enough talk. I'm gonna keep going with this because my brain is fucking hurt. This TV show is hard to understand. I got a chills. Uh, you know, certain scenes definitely when that woman mentioned to to Cole about uh, the Carcosa and the way Cole felt about it, you know? That's why I still like feel the Cole is somehow connected with all this. Guys, if that's so, it will be like one of the biggest twists on TV show history, you know? But I don't want to like keep assuming, keep giving assumptions. Let's wait and see. Yes, guys, uh, as always, uh, if you like the video, press the like button, comment if you think you know, miss something, say something dumb. Uh, should know something about this episode before I put it to the side. Share with your friends if you like to watch someone else reacting to this incredible TV show, other TV shows I'm doing, other TV shows I did, and other TV shows I'll be doing. And subscribe to the channel, give me a lot of energy, so keep strong, it's right and to keep these things with you guys. And yes, as always, hope you're having fun, and most of all, stay safe guys, have a good one, thank you.